why don't we all right now to soak into what God is doing, this revival movement. I invite you to sow. The Bible says when you sow, you will reap. That when you, when you sow, this revival movement is expanding with your seed. Not only that, the revival is expanding in your life. You are reaping anointing in your life. This is one of the ways to receive true impartation. And even all of the anointing does, the healing, the freedom. When you sow, truly more anointing comes in your life. This is a spiritual thing that happens. This is how we receive the supernatural resources from heaven. From physical to, to spiritual. From financial to the spiritual needs that we have. So, if you like to sow, we have, um, how are we doing this year? Um, Mystica? Mystica? Yeah, she's right there. Okay, just wondering how we should do this year with the and is that how Okay, she's going to take this around. And there's another one. So, um, and should they bring their offering in the basket here? In the empty basket here? Okay, so we can have Okay, so bring the offering right here. Okay, so we're going to, so you can come here. And there's, there's envelopes here if you'd like to give online. There's a QR code, uh, right on the And you can just place the offering. Is there cash now to tell them? And every one of you who are giving, I declare this anointing to pour more and more in your life and you to reap all that you're sowing. And I declare you to remain free in Jesus' name. That the devil cannot take anything from you. All God's blessings, I declare protection over them in your life. In Jesus' name. And also as you're coming forth to give, do I have everyone's attention here? Amen. If you're as you're coming forth to give now, I want to invite you to share your testimony. So I'm telling right here is going to fill testimonies right after this. Now, so many people are able to receive miracles because testimonies have been shared. Your testimony is special and the world needs it. People need it out there because they don't have certain faith that your testimony, specifically your testimony, is going to release that faith to them. Do I have everyone's attention just because it's important? I don't want to miss, want you to miss out on sharing your testimony because the Bible says that they overcame by the blood of the Lamb and the word of their testimony. So maintaining your freedom, this is one of the keys. When you share your testimony, you are overcoming the devil's schemes to try to take your freedom. So if you've been free today, or if God touched you here or maybe online, share your testimony. It's such a powerful thing you're doing in the kingdom for your spiritual health and for the God's people.